tell Felicia her father's still alive, but I need to get all the facts straight first. Classified file, John Hardesky, alias The Cat, 1943. Now, John Hardesky would have only been a boy of 13. It seems that his file begins here, with him creeping into a top secret facility, thinking that he'd been hired by the government to spy on Nazis. Trained as an acrobat, the boy possessed tremendous agility. Gentlemen, it is time to unveil the volunteer for this top secret experiment. Private Steve Rogers. Young man, the risk you take today could very well tip the scales of the war in our favor. I pray it does, sir. But Hardesky had one other important skill, a photographic memory. And with it, he undertook the mission of memorizing a top secret formula. It won't be long now. This is only the beginning. That secret formula held the key to producing an amazing transformation in a normal human being. Rogers is merely the first of a new breed of super soldiers who will free the world from the tyranny of the Axis powers. Gentlemen, meet the new champion of the Allied forces, Captain America. Young Hardesky realized that what he had seen being made that night was history. It was also tragedy. In the name of the Fatherland, I will destroy this American war machine. Run! It's going to explode! Hardesky escaped from the exploding complex, but there were new realizations that clouded the success of his mission. I'm here for deliveries. Storeroom. Ah, Cat, you made it back. Were you able to retrieve the information? I would expect nothing less from the son of the great Hardesky, the finest escape artist of our time. I memorized the formula, but there's something I don't understand. Why would Axis spies name their agent Captain America? <laughs> they weren't Nazis, were they? You're the Nazis. You're trying to get me to betray my country. I'll never tell anyone the formula. Never! After him, you fools! Don't let him escape! John Hardesky grew up to be the cat. S.H.I.E.L.D. took him into custody to prevent the super soldier formula from falling into the wrong hands. Felicia's mom must have changed their name. But what do I tell Felicia? Hey, I've got some good news and some bad news. Well, the good news is your father's still alive. The bad is they've locked him up and thrown away the key because he knows to. This is a demo.